Hi there. Welcome back to our next session on Android. In this session we will learn about using Android widgets like buttons, labels, web view, progress bar, etc. So, let's start with widgets. In Android, the word widget is a generic term for a bit of self-contained code that displays a program, or a piece of a program, that is also a shortcut to a larger application. There are given a lot of Android widgets with simplified examples such as button, edit text, auto-complete text view, toggle button, date picker, time picker, and progress bar etc. They are very easy to use. We will see some of the mostly used widgets in Android with example. See it carefully. You should try to do it along with the video. Now let's see Android button widget. Android button represents a push button. The android.widget.button is subclass of text view class and compound button is the subclass of button class. There are different types of buttons in Android such as radio button, toggle button, compound button etc. Now let's see the example of android button. In this example we are going to create a sum calculator application. You need to follow the steps. Now let's see Android Toast. An Android Toast is a small message displayed on the screen, similar to a tooltip or other similar pop-up notification. A Toast is displayed on top of the main content of an activity, and only remains visible for a short time period. Android Toast can be used to display information for the short period of time. A Toast contains message to be displayed quickly and disappears after some time. The android.widget.toast class is the subclass of java.lang.object class. Let's see it with an example.
Now let's talk about toggle button. Android toggle button can be used to display checked or unchecked, on or off state on the button. It is beneficial if user have to change the setting between two states. It can be used to on or off sound, Wi-Fi, Bluetooth etc. Since Android 4.0, there is another type of toggle button called switch that provides slider control. Android toggle button and switch both are the subclasses of compound button class. Now see the example for better understanding. Create two toggle button from the widget list. You can drag and drop it on your layout design view. Now we will see alert dialog box. Android alert dialog can be used to display the dialog message with OK and cancel buttons. It can be used to interrupt and ask the user about his or her choice to continue or discontinue. Android alert dialog is composed of three regions, title, content area, and action buttons. Android alert dialog is the subclass of dialog class. Let's understand it with an example. Follow the steps shown, I will provide you the program codes. Try to do it along with the video.
Let's talk about Android Web View. Android Web View is used to display web page in Android. The web page can be loaded from same application or URL. It is used to display online content in Android activity. Android Web View uses WebKit engine to display web page. The android.wekit.webview is the subclass of absolute layout class. The load URL and load data methods of Android Web View class are used to load and display web page. To load data from website, you need to provide special permission to allow your application to access internet. You can provide that permission in Android Manifest XML file in the application tag. Watch the given example carefully you can see the permission provided. In the web view you can display simple HTML code as well. Follow the example carefully. Now we will see progress bar in Android. We can display the Android progress bar dialog box to display the status of work being done like, downloading file, analyzing status of work etc. The progress dialog class provides methods to work on progress bar like set progress, set message, set progress dial, set max, show, etc. The progress range of progress dialog is 0 to 10,000. Let's understand it with an example. In this example, we are displaying the progress dialog for dummy file download operation. We are using Android.app progress dialog class to show the progress bar. Android progress dialog is the subclass of alert dialog class. Follow the steps. Hope you liked the video we will get to know more topics in our upcoming sessions. Till then thank you.